the Prime Minister of Ethiopia, Abiy Ahmed, has paid a visit to the capital of Tigray for the first time since he ordered a military offensive against the region. Abiy Ahmed made the trip a day ahead of the resumption of civil services and business activities as announced by the Interim Administration for Tigray Regional State. The Prime Minister also held discussions with army generals who led the fight by the government in November against the forces of the Tigray People's Liberation Front stationed in Tigray. His visit comes a day before the Sudanese Prime Minister Abdullah Amdok said he had agreed with his counterpart in Addis Ababa to hold an urgent meeting of a bloc of East African countries to resolve the crisis in Tigray. Ethiopia's government said it took military action against TPLF after the region's forces attacked a military camp of federal troops in November. The Abiy government considered a regional government led by the Tigray People's Liberation Front as illegitimate. The TPLF denied staging the attack. The conflict has alarmed the international humanitarian community since the eruption in violence has largely caught the Tigray region of 6 million people off from the world. Earlier, the international aid convoy carrying medicines and relief supplies was cleared to go to Mekele and the International Committee of the Red Cross said more is still needed. Kamil Sadiq reporting for CBA TV.